I was the sponsor, the, the prime sponsor of the lottery bill. I carried the legislation that created the lottery corporation back for Governor Wilkinson. And uh, Keno was discussed back then. And we drafted the language uh, specifically to give the lottery corporation the ability to maintain the flexibility that it's had through all these years because there are games that are constantly evolving in, in the world of lotteries. Uh, Multi-state Powerball wasn't anything that anybody saw on the horizon back when the lottery legislation was adopted, Mr. Chairman, but obviously because the definition of lottery type games is broad enough that allows them to expand and generate more monies through the expansion of lottery type games. Keno is a lottery type game and it's played by a, a different uh, customer. It's a rapid game. Uh, drawings are done rapidly, not, you don't have to buy a ticket and wait till the Powerball or wait till that night or, you know, when the, when the, the pick three or whatever uh, is done. Uh, so you won't see Keno machines probably at any of the fast food, uh, I mean, the, the, uh, the gas stations, the convenience stores and those type of places. They'll continue doing what they do, selling tickets for the customers that are already out there. Keno generates President Gleason says, a new audience. And so I asked him, well, what do you think the projections are if you were to engage in those games, which you have the statutory authority to do already? And those are the numbers that I'll be sharing with you uh, here in just a second. I wanted to explain that briefly before we got into the actual uh, bill content and what these numbers mean. The other funding source is instant racing that I'm proposing. Instant racing is the uh, historical racing that the Franklin Circuit Court upheld. It was <laughs> authorized by the Racing Commission. Uh, that case is before the Supreme Court, but the current state of the law in Kentucky is that instant racing, or what we call historical racing in this bill, is currently legal in Kentucky. It's being conducted at two racetracks at Kentucky Downs down uh, just south of Bowling Green, Mr. Speaker, and uh, Ellis Park at Henderson, Dr. Watkins, just started. And you'll see some numbers here in just a little bit that it's pretty, it's pretty uh, productive. It's, it's being accepted well, and uh, we think that, that if the court upholds that, that that is a funding source that we can capture.